Hey everyone, welcome back to Tom Gillis Golf Instruction, my channel, whatever you want to call it. I appreciate it. Uh, thanks for stopping in for my weekly review of last week's events, driving edition, as I am in a hurry. Well, not a hurry, but I don't have a lot of time to make videos at the moment. So we're going to do it while we drive. Uh, I do have some notes. If I look at them, don't hold it against me because that's uh, an impromptu one here. So, But I thank you all for coming. And if, if you would like the to um, smash that like button as they say subscribe to the channel we got good stuff coming more golf content coming in I'm starting to film stuff as we go here and um, good tips for to help your slice or help your pull hook or help your top whatever email me Tom Gillis pga.com for any help or questions I, I do online coaching as well not just swing tips but also you know course management how to think how to prepare all that stuff i've been there done it still focusing on it still trying to um, improve myself and my players that i coach um, live in person and now taking it uh, worldwide i guess with the uh, interwebs here so um, give me a shot you may uh, you may like what you see and if you don't then uh, don't come back anymore but uh, I i'm pretty sure you will because i have a pretty good retention rate so um, again, welcome back. Please subscribe to the channel. I thank you all. Returning people, um, subscribers, thank you so much for helping me get over 500. I think I'm up to 530 now. I've got to get to that magic thousand and that'll unload a whole new uh, world for me. And I appreciate it, all you folks. If you could share and tell your friends, that would be great. So let's get to it. Uh, Rocket Mortgage Championship. Pretty good round uh, by uh, Mr. Finau. Pretty good tournament, excuse me, by Mr. Finau, who I posted on my Twitter account last week is going to get on a roll, and uh, and he did. I didn't realize this quick, but but he did. You know, beating Cam Cam Young, um, uh, Patrick Cantlay was up there at the end too. Cam Young, uh, how about him? He's going to be a stud if he just keeps on doing what he's doing and doesn't try to start changing things. So. Congratulations, Tony Finau, two in a row. What a great guy. If you watch his stuff on uh, Twitter and uh, uh, pjtour.com, whatever, just an honest, a, it's just a humble guy, just a good dude, a guy you want to root for. And uh, and we and we certainly did. So uh, the Women's Scottish Open, her name, Ayanka Faruwu, I think her name is. Uh, I didn't see too much of that as I had other things going on, but she's, I know she shot a like a 62-61 in the final round to, to win that. Uh, good for her, and I think she's a youngster, so that'll secure her card and um, get her ready for this week's event. Uh, I don't think there was a Champions Tour event this week. They're off, um, they're playing this week, but last week they were off. Same thing with the Corn Ferry Tour. A um, lot of action this coming week in golf. The Live Tour, if you are interested, Henrik Stenson, after being um, snubbed or kicked off the Ryder Cup captaincy, won uh, the individual event. I think he was 11 under. He won by two or three shots over Dustin Johnson and uh, I believe Matthew Wolf. He made four million for his um, his efforts, which is three times as much as Mr. Finau won, and twice as much as he's won in his two weeks. But wherever you stand on that, that's just information on that and uh, the four aces. <laughs> four aces they won again so they're the they're the new york yankees of um of live golf i guess so um uh, that's that uh otherwise um a slower week in golf again tony fino congratulations now coming up um the fedex cup playoffs they start um in two weeks this week though is the wyndham championship the final round the final event to qualify for the top 125 uh, that gets you into the playoffs in your card for next year and I think 12 live guys are bumped out as of right now they're going to court for this so who knows what's gonna happen it's gonna be nuts so hold on to your hat you know it's gonna be crazy but uh, if those 12 guys are out and I'm assuming they are at the moment Right now, you know, we got Ricky Fowler at 123, Matt Wallace 124, Austin Smotherman 125, Max McGreevy 126, and Danny Willett, former Masters champion. He's kind of fallen off the map a little bit, but getting his game back at 127. So hold on for that. It should be a good, um, good weekend. And the Bubble Boys, 
uh, are going to be fighting for their card for next year in the playoffs. Because I believe next year the playoffs starts at 70 guys. So now it goes 125, 70, 30, uh, 70, 30. Then it's just going to go 70, 30, I believe. So, um, yeah, it's going to be different next year. And now also the PGA Tour schedule come out. And unfortunately for us in the Northeast, the Northeast corridor, Philly, Boston, New York, and all that, there's no tournaments that I saw. Now, I might be missing something. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments down below. Just comment, Tom, you are wrong. There is one in that area. I know there's one in Rochester, New York, but I don't think that's the East Coast per se. So, um, yeah, let me know what your thoughts on that are. Obviously, you know, shoot me an email or I'll leave a comment down below anything anything to just let me know what you think on that but uh a lot of traveling according to some people you know they're not just going from a b c they're going from a to z to q to l to x you know so a lot of traveling for those guys and um we'll see what happens but hey they, they got private jets right so i don't i don't i don't um they're not they'll be fine they'll be fine they're not going to be uh, too discomforted traveling playing golf for money right so we all got to uh, drive our cars and uh, sleep in our cars and all that crap to, to play golf. So, But still, nothing in the Northeast Corridor, which I thought was pretty um, pretty disappointing. Because we used to have, I'm in, uh, in New England, in Boston, we had a tournament, Deutsche Bank at TPC Boston. I thought it was well attended and all that. And, uh, we just had the U.S. Open here, which was jammed. So there, I don't see why we can't have a, a tournament here. But... Um, How's my camera bouncing around? Let me try to snag it on a little bit better for you. There we go. Well, it's the, whoa, it is the driving edition of Tom Gillis Golf Instruction. And that's, uh, unfortunately, that's what we have right now. Let's see. What else is going on in the world of golf? Uh, ba, ba, ba. PGA Tour schedule. Oh, uh, Scotty Scheffler is still number one in the FedEx Cup. Camp Smith's number two. I, I believe they will finish in those spots whether they play this week or not. Uh, ba, ba, ba. So, yeah. And again, I want to really thank everybody for coming and checking it out. I know it's new. It's raw stuff. I'm learning how to edit and all that stuff. And it's taking my time. I got a bouncing camera. So I'll figure it out. But I, I know my talk, my shit about golf. I know what I'm talking about. All this other stuff is just fluff, I guess. But um, again, email me with any questions comment down below how to help your game and all that and if you're interested in the online coaching not again not just video swings and all that but but the whole nine yards we can talk about something that'll help your game out and how often and when to do it uh, i'd appreciate that subscribe button would be fantastic and um, yeah just enjoying the channel check out the other videos and, and, and again there's more coming i still my leg is still messed up so it's hard for me to get out there and and hit balls and all that but i will be having uh some more stuff coming i'll be doing reviews of clubs and balls and clothes and hats and golf courses and, and you know just trying to give my thoughts on what's happening in the world of golf and um, with some by bi non-biased opinions i don't have a uh a, a, a shoe in the foot of any other game whatever the hell that means right that was stupid but i'm not biased so i, I just give you my honest opinion of what's happening i've been doing this for 35 years and um, i i think i do pretty good at it and, and help people so um not always perfect i guess but hey what can you do so uh, again thanks for checking me out check all my other videos subscribe and like and um uh, let, well, wait, before I go, let's go. Next week's tournaments. I'm sorry, next week's tournaments. So the Wyndham Classic is the last one of this season before the FedEx Cup playoffs for the Tour. Champions Tour, I believe, is at the Shaw Classic. Corn Ferry Tour is at the Utah Championship. And the uh, Women's uh, British Open. Oh, that's what I'm going to talk about for a couple seconds. Is that Muirfield, up until a few years ago, they didn't have any women members. Now they do, and now they're having this tournament. So that should... Uh, Make people happy for be all inclusive for all that. Um, as far as the other races, genders, thingies they have, I don't know, but um, I'm sure that will come up this week at the Women's British Open. One Ferry Tour, I said, and then the Live Tournament is not till September in my neck of the woods, at the International in Boston, Massachusetts. So um, I don't know if I'm going or not. As a uh, fan, and a 
uh, whatever I am now, media reporter, YouTuber. I don't know if I should go and ask people. I don't know what I should do. Um, I'm, if I do go, it will be as a reporter type thing. Um, but again, my knee is messed up, so it's hard for me to walk. So I'm, I'm not sure what's going to happen. So again, uh, thanks for everything. Thanks for tuning in. Things will get better as I keep growing this channel. And uh, I'll be more uh, professional, I guess, with the videos and all that stuff soon. So uh, I will talk to you all soon. Have a great day. And I hope you guys have a, a good golf uh, week yourself. And I will... Uh, See you next time. Thank you.